It's the wild world of Farley. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Actually, do Ah! Actually, move. Move a lot. Yeah. My Walden people, welcome to the wild world of Farley. Let's get it, stay wildin'. What's up my Walden people? Welcome to another episode of Wild World of Farley with your boy Farley. Guys, we're right outside Predatory Fins, if you guys can see. Boy, we'll catch them all fishing there. Rod's right up, wait, what? What's going on? Wait, what? Oh my God, <laughs> this guy. Come on, come on. All right, perfect, perfect. Guys, we're right here at Predatory Fins, and guess what I'm gonna do? Pick up some fish. So enough of me talking. Let's get right into this. Let's get it. My boy Joey Slayer. What's up? What's up, Rod? How you doing? Hey, hey, what the fish? Hey, what's up, catch them all? Alright, so what we're here for? It was right here for these jellyfish, guys. You guys have spoken and uh obstruction. Ooh. We're good, we're good, we're good, and we're great. Guys, you guys have spoken, plus I already want these. These beautiful, beautiful, cuddly looking jellyfish. That's right, jelly catfish, guys. So guess what? We're taking two of them and bringing them home to the wild world of Farley. Ah! Farley, what you doing? I'm trying to pick up. I'm trying to pick up. I'm trying to pick up. Are you alive? Yeah, we're alive. Oh, look at that one. That was having some action right over here in the corner, guys. Let's come take a look. What's all that white stuff floating on that? What? You were a doctor, were you? No. What is what? All that white stuff. All that like, white stuff. What do you think that is? I think. I think someone's trying to make a baby around hey, here. Oh, jelly <laughs> catfish. <laughs> oh my gosh. Alright guys, so I'm looking for the best two catfish, guys. I'm one, I want a pair, I want a pair. Guys, help me choose. Come take a closer look. Help me choose. Mm. I think the two right over here. Where? Right over here, right over here in the corner. Behind this? Behind, behind this? Us. Behind me, on the side of me. Oh, right there. Oh, look at that guy. He almost wants to go in here. Oh, guys, they look like good ornaments right over here. Oh, that guy right over here. Where? This guy. Two for oh, one? Oh, two for one, two for one, and we got him. Almost, almost, and we got him, guys. We got him. Got my two jelly cat fit. Ooh, we actually do. Ah! We actually do. Move a lot. Ooh, wee, wee. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And we are good. Nice. Look at him. That is beautiful. We're going to go inside, outside. <laughs> wow. They are pretty cool. They are pretty cool. I like them. I like them too. Are you good? Yeah. How big are we talking? As big as a red tail. Let's get it, baby. What? Now it's time to go home to the wild world of Barley and bring these babies back to you. All right, my wild and people. Shout out to Predatory Fins, bro. I appreciate you. Thanks for hooking it up. Till next time. Yeah, yeah. It's the wild world of Farley. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, my wild people. So we're back and look at these babies, looking so amazing. Oh, they've been, they've been kind of fighting me in the back. Guys, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to put them in this tank right here and allow them to activate for just a little bit. And then we'll release them into their temporary home. Yeah, yeah. We'll be back in 15 minutes. All right, my wild people. So it's been about, about 15 minutes. The fish are ready to go into their new home. Let's take a good look at them. They're very interesting fish. Let's take a closer look at them. Ooh. Ooh wee. Whoa. Wow. They're so cool looking. Oh my god. Look at the mouths on these babies. Oh my god. Okay. Ooh. Don't want to stress them out too much, but just want to take a closer look at them. Look how beautiful they are. I like the little spots. I like the kind of tannish yellow spots that they have. The patterns. It's really, really unique. And apparently these can grow to be about two to three feet long. So I'm excited about that because guys, I love monster fish. So guys, just release this guy. Ooh, I see why they call him Jelly. He feels so soft. So just release this guy into his new temporary home. Get free! Oh yeah, yeah. Look at that send off. Poop. He's just loving life right now, guys. All right, now to release the second one. Let's scoop this guy up. Take a look at them. Make sure they're A-OK. -okay. No lesions, no marks, no, ooh, relax, relax, my friend. No lesions, no, ooh, wee. No lesions, no marks, no nothing. Ooh, I feel, ooh, okay, okay, he's mad. Let's release him into his new temporary home. Oh, 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 draft that, oh, what's going on? Draft nose just got booted. Now draft nose has to find another home. Or another resting spot. 
All right, guys, so as you guys can see, look at the nice rusted color of these fish. These fish are actually very amazing. I really, really like them. I'm not even gonna lie, I saw one on Instagram and I was like, man, I have to have one of these. Better yet, why not too? Because I like to get. I like to get fish in pairs, so I ended up getting two of these jelly catfish. You guys take a look at how beautiful this jelly catfish is. The jelly catfish don't really like light, and they are aggressive. If you guys did notice, where are you going? So they're gonna try to burrow, and they're always gonna try to hide. They like the dark, and they, they do get along with other fish, but they are aggressive, and they have big mouths. Let's see if we can see a big mouth. These jelly catfish have enormous mouths. Take a look at that, oh my god. Yeah, they got some pretty big mouths. Okay, he's a little embarrassed right now. And these catfish will try to eat anything that can fit in their mouths. That's why if you do put them with tank mates, you have to make sure the tank mates are bigger than them and that they cannot fit in their mouths. Guys, it's always recommended to maybe have one because they are highly aggressive fish from what I can tell. But they have enough room to move in this tank and they have a lot of different hiding areas. They do like to cuddle. As you guys can see, they're over here standing nice and warm. And I've put them in the 75 gallon tank temporarily so they can get accustomed to other fish. And every fish in here is pretty much bigger than them, so we don't have to worry about these jelly catfish eating my other fish. Can't wait to see them grow to be four feet long and eventually make their way to Catfish Kingdom. And from Catfish Kingdom to Olympia. All right, my wild people, it's time to catch Bassy and Bassy Jr. some snacks. So guys, guess what we're gonna do? Do just that. I got my cast net, gotta cast it a couple times, and let's see if we can get some bluegills. If we get enough, maybe we'll go peacock fishing. Ooh. Ooh. That almost took me. We let it sink, we let it sink. Oh, I got something. Felt the push, felt the power, felt the fish. And oh my god. Big tilapia, oh my god. Yeah. Wow, <laughs> this is a Look pretty at massive tilapia, guys. Holy crap. Right, whoa. All right, guys, we we're looking for bluegill. We don't need this massive tilapia. I may take it, maybe cut it up, and maybe feed it to my fish. I'm deciding. Let's take a, let's take a closer look at it. Felt that power. It's insane. Come on, big boy. Whoa, this really is a big boy. Flip or die. Get out of my net. It's a big boy. Look at that no! slide. Goodbye, my friend. I really need him. Yeah, yeah. I'm cleaning the lake. Cleaning the lake. <laughs> All right. That was good. Let's see if it was good enough. I think I'm not caught. Let it sink, and now we pull. Yeah, yeah. Guys, take a look at that. We got them can. Oh my god, guys, we did well. Oh. We did really well. This blue oh my god, guys, this is blue gill heaven. Yeah, yeah. All right, guys, so looks like we're going peacock fishing. All right, guys. Let's oh my god. Maybe Bassy Jr. is going to like this little piece of candy right here. Let's see it. Yeah, it's a nice size. A nice little blue gill for Bassy Jr. That's candy. Everything else? For Bassy. Six, seven. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Eight. Seven, 12, 13, 14. We got over 14, guys. So we, so we did great. All right, my wild people. So we made it back home to the wild world of fighting, guys. Look at Bassy. There's Bassy right there. Bassy, how you look? look. Oh, she's coming close. She's coming close. Guys, we have some snacks. We have some snacks for her. So let's get a nice, nice snack. Ooh. Oh, that one's a big boy. Ooh, wee. Yeah, this is a big boy. Look at that. What you gotta say? You gotta say something? Uh, I guess not. Oh my god, guys, take a look at Scar. Scar got that nasty scratch. Looks like there's been a battle. Looks like the fish are fighting for aggression, but guys, look at Bassy. Can you guys see Bassy? Yeah. Oh, Bassy sees the fish now. He's Ooh. oh Bassy's ready. Alright guys, watch this. Oh my god! Oh, Okay, Bassie almost went from my hand. Got a little scared there, didn't you? Yeah, you saw her, she's hungry. <laughs> See if Bassie wants to slurp. Oh my God. All right, guys, I didn't hold on to the tail tight enough. But Bassie's happy, so I'm happy. I'm just looking for a big, a nice medium size. This is perfect. Guys, I'm gonna try to hold it very tight this time by the tail. It's not going, it's not going anywhere. 
Bassie's. Oh my god! I just can't hold it by the tail, guys! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Take a look at the bluegills, guys. Let's find the smallest bluegill possible. Looks like that guy right there. Got him. Oh, yeah, this is small. Guys, we're gonna feed this to Bessie Jr. So come on. What'd that bag ever do to you? Yeah, be like that. All right. Let's see, let's see. This is Bassie Jr. This is a bluegill. Bassie Jr., bluegill. Bassie Jr., bluegill. Oh, oh, he wants it. All right, guys, pay attention to him. Let's see what happens. Three, two, one. He's thinking about it. Has to get ahead first. Oh, oh, oh! He tried, he tried, he tried. He tried. He's watching it, he's watching it. He's gonna get it. He is going to get it. Oh, 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 he had the tail! He needs to get ahead first. Let's see, he's, he's coming back, he's coming back. The blue gill is still. This might be the time he strikes. Oh, he's going, he's going, he's going. Oh! He got a tail. He didn't get it head first. He didn't get it head first. But he's still munching away. He's, oh, he got it. He's maneuvering it. He's maneuvering it. He's maneuvering it. Oh, he bit it a couple of times. He's just waiting to go in for the kill. My poor boy, Bassie Jr. That was a little too big for you, right, buddy? All right, guys. Bassie Jr. gave a valiant effort, but it wasn't good enough. The blue gill was just a little bit too big. Well, we all know Bessie Jr. loves worms, so guys, we're gonna give him some worms. I got two worms, and let's see if Bessie Jr. will slurp them. He's thinking about it, he's thinking about it, and yeah, yeah, okay, that's my boy. <laughs> Look at that, the channel catfish trying to do something too. You gotta make sure you're well fed, my friend, well fed. Don't worry, you'll get bigger when you're bigger. You'll be able to destroy those bigger bluegill. All right, my welcome people. I hope you enjoyed this episode, guys. Welcome my two new catfish. Where are they? Jelly catfish number one and jelly catfish number two. Getting along oh so well with the draft nose catfish. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Until next time, stay wildin'. Hey, hey, you viewer. Before you go, I want to say thanks for watching. Apart from that, if you haven't already, subscribe, give me a like, and of course, stay wildin'.